This is Nick Peters with Comcore's video blog, What Were They Thinking? Earlier this week, two female co-stars of ABC TV's women-oriented talk show, The View, ridiculed Miss America contestant Kelly Johnson on the air for her performance the night before during the pageant's talent competition. In real life, Johnson is a hospital nurse who graduated from nursing studies as class valedictorian. For her talent demo, rather than sing or play music in a gown, Johnson opted for a touching monologue about her bedside relationship with an Alzheimer's patient named Joe, who symbolized for her why she became a nurse in the first place. She wore her usual work attire, simple nurse of scrubs with a stethoscope around the neck. On The View the next day, with the full body image of Johnson on screen behind them, co-host Michelle Collins said sarcastically while rolling her eyes, she came in in a nurse's uniform and basically read her emails out loud and shockingly she didn't win. Co-host Joy Behar chimed in mockingly, why did she have a doctor's stethoscope around her neck as the rest of the co-hosts cackled out loud. Well, nurses nationwide tweeted protests with hashtags like nurses unite and nurses share your stethoscopes and posted furious responses to The View on Facebook. Collins and Behar later apologized profusely after the backlash. Collins, quote, I, for all of us, want to say we love nurses. Nurses, if you're watching, we adore you, we respect you, unquote. Said Behar, quote, I didn't know what I was talking about, unquote. Evidently, what were they thinking indeed? In today's social media world, it isn't overly PC to recognize that an unscripted joke is only good when it's actually funny or relevant. Ridicule is a double-edged sword, so you have to pick your spots carefully. It's in the eye and ear of the beholder. Of course there's room for humor and edgy satire. Our Constitution protects that freedom. But that won't protect you if it comes back to bite you. Public figures and spokespeople should pause for just a moment before being off-handedly flip about an entire class of people. Plus, in the case of people whose job is to protect, save, or deliver life, you never know when you might need one. I'm Nick Peters in Washington. Follow Comcore on Facebook and Twitter.